two graphs look different, but are they from a graph theory point of view structurally the same? If you look closely, you see that they are structurally the same. They are the same up to the renaming of the vertices. In fact, we can define a function that renames vertices of a first graph as in second graph. These graphs are isomorphic. The renaming function f is an isomorphism. Formally, g1 and g2 are isomorphic if there is a bijection f from v1 to v2 with the property that a and b are adjacent in g1 if and only if f of a and f of b are adjacent in g2 for all a and b in v1. Function f is called isomorphism. An isomorphism f preserves edges, thus preserving properties of graphs that depend on edges. That means cycles and degrees are preserved. It's often easy to show that two graphs are not isomorphic. For instance, if they have a different number of vertices or edges, or if the degree of the vertices do not match up. But showing that they are isomorphic requires that an isomorphism can actually be produced, which is much harder. For instance, look at these two graphs. The orange graph has two vertices of degree 3, while the blue graph has none, so they are not isomorphic. How about these two? Can you find an one-to-one -one and onto function to map all vertices of one graph to other one? And these two? Same number of vertices, same number of edges, same number of vertices of each degree, but... If these two graphs are isomorphic, then A must correspond to either T, U, X, or Y. T, U, X, and Y all have a neighbor with degree 2, which is not true for A, so they are not isomorphic. But why should we want to know whether two graphs are isomorphic? What sort of problem can be solved? Any idea? Share them with us and others in the forum.